Support. The Maestro, please! First week of August, and it's not off to a bad start. This'll be for the week of August 7th. 2021. On this day in music back in 1960, Chubby Checker appeared on Dick Clark's American Bandstand in which he performed a cover of Hank Ballard's The Twist, starting arguably the largest dance craze in the United States of, well, The Twist. <laughs> first instrumental album from Peter Holland's legendary vocals, aptly named Legendary Instrumentals, performed by the Brooklyn Duo. This is a collection of songs from their various Brooklyn Sessions recordings. Don't mean a thing if it ain't got that swing. <laughs> Yet another Blue Note classic vinyl edition, this time of Dexter Gordon's 1962 album, Go, which oddly enough, just two years ago, was added to the National Recording Registry in the United States. Singing, I love rock and roll. Well, I can find my way, I know my left from right, because we never close, I'm open to album of Paul McCartney's latest studio album, McCartney 3, and some big names on here, Dominic Fike, Beck, St. Vincent, Phoebe Bridges, Anderson Pock, and if you get the physical edition, Idris Elba. Running something that cost six figures to get the pay tag With a bitch who say she the realest but she got fake ass I'll pop all these perks when I do Major label debut from ESTG After getting some attention back in 2020 with I Don't Feel None We now get the major label debut mixtape Bigger Than Life or Death Signed to both Interscope Records and Yo Gotti's Collective Music Group <laughs> A new Grizz charted at number nine, and I need that just to get up into the top five, because I always enjoy Grizz's music. And now I need some help from the maestro, please! Show you my mama Tisha, show you so she like my demeanor, and she look like a Unfortunately, I do not believe that Faith is going to have the staying power that Shoot for the Moon, Aim for the Stars had. I think I wanna stay right here tonight, cause I can be dangerous. Fun fact, Get Into It Ya yeah, actually interpolates Massive Attack by Nicki Minaj and Sean Garrett, which was Nicki Minaj's debut single, I might add. I got my driver's license last week, just like we always talked about. They've announced the fourth single for this album, which is going to be released as such on the 9th. It's gonna be Traitor. I need you to stay. Yet another edition of F Love by The Kid Leroy. This is the third one, if the three didn't tip you off, called F Love Over You, which itself has an additional expanded edition titled F Love 3 Plus Over You. August not off to a bad start. We can begin getting our back to school playlists together if you are indeed going back to school. And now I need some help on my stove, please. My stove. 